What's up, Hitting the Town viewers and fans from across the world? Welcome to this special edition of Hitting the Town. I'm your host, Tony Towns, and for all those that don't know, now you know. It's Black History Month, and I ain't even black. On today's episode, we will show you some of the most annoying ass people that gave black people a bad rap and set us back at least 50 years. We'll also show you a list of people who we celebrate for inspiring us, motivating us, and gave us a good name. And let the countdown begin. Blacks who have set us back at least 50 years. And here are the names. Stacey Dash, the Kardashians, that damn Ben Carson, and Omarosa. But listen, Omarosa, I can't wait for you to write that book. The character Steven and Django Unchained. Diamond and Silk, these two black women were the Trump supporters. Monique and Precious. Ooh, she threw that frying pan at Precious! <laughs> and Dennis Rodman's stupid ass for going over to North Korea, making good friends with Kim Jong-un. Is it Kim Jong-un or Kim Jong-il? Uh. <laughs> na 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 na. <laughs> also, who set us back 50 years? That white girl, that catch me outside girl, I don't even know her name, Danielle or something. She's horrible. Black people are not like that. Miley Cyrus. See, Miley, let me tell you something about Miley. Molly's crazy ass, one minute she white, the next minute she black, then the next minute she Miley. She go from Miley to Mylesha to Miley. It's hard being black and Molly Cyrus. Yes, it is. Our good friend Ike Turner, he's also on the list for horrible people. Why? Because he beat Tina Turner's ass. But in spite of that ass whooping, she made some pretty amazing music. Don't you agree? Uh-huh. That Coon, can I call him a coon? That coon, Milwaukee Sheriff David Clark, who literally disrespected all black people across the world. And let us not forget, is the pudding good? Is the producing good? Bill Cosby. Bill, you, let me calm down. Bill, you shaded black young men across this country so much, pull your pants up. Go to college, get an education. Yet your ass was slipping those little things, those little, what, did he, what, is he, what does he call them? those little roofies and those women drinks and raping them. Allegedly, I'll say allegedly for legal purposes. Last but certainly not least, our friend, the homegirl, Sally Mae. Why? Because those damn student loans cost too much. Is there a way for me to return a degree? I mean, personally, I don't have any student loans, but I was wondering, is there a way to return the damn degree? Why? Because it costs too much. Y'all didn't say getting a degree will cost as much. You get out of school and then you turn around and try to get a job. And you can't get a job. So what does that mean? I want to return to Cinder. Now we turn our attention to those who we celebrate for black excellence for inspiring us all. We got to start out with our sister, our auntie, our grandmama, Maxine Waters, a.k.a. Aunt Maxine. Aunt Maxine! Aunt Maxine! We love your sister Maxine. She's sister Maxine at the church house. Our homegirl, Angela Rahu, who go on CNN and be like, bye Felicia. She said bye Felicia to Amarosa because her and Amarosa really don't get along. So Angela Rahu, we stand with you. She also got a new show on BET. Let's hope they don't cancel it because you know how they asses do. <laughs> love you BET. Next on our list of people who inspire us, The Breakfast Club. Charlemagne the God, Angela Yeezy, and our boy DJ Envy. We thank y'all for standing up and bringing on black voices and people who look like us and make us feel that we're worthy of something important. And can I, listen, I can't even, I don't even know how to say this. The Obamas, Michelle, Malia, Sasha, President Obama, you, you guys are the standard barrier of who we are as a people. Thank you to the Obamas for inspiring us. Ida B. Wells, Gary Owens, the entire cast of Black Panther. Eminem, we know you're a brother. You're from Detroit. We know you're a brother. Thank you for calling out Donald Trump for all his bigotry and racism and telling white people, it's time for y'all to step up and fight with us because we are human people. We're a human race. Kamala Harris, you will be our next president. Thank you so much for inspiring us all. Lucius Lyon, Bill Clinton, you are our first black president, and we salute you, my brother. Constance Landry, is the elephant heavy? Yes, it is. To the people of Flint, my family, my friends, thank you all for staying strong, even though y'all asses still ain't got no water. 
Shame on you, America. And all those African countries Trump called shitholes. We celebrate you. We celebrate all the black fathers that are trying to be in their kids' lives and all those fathers that are in their kids' lives. We stand with you. Thank you for your service and your black excellence. Let's see who will make our list next year. Will it be you? Thank you so much for watching another episode of Hitting the Town. We appreciate your support. Now we are glad that you are watching, but you all know you haven't subscribed to our channel yet. Please like our videos, share them, comment on them, but most importantly, please subscribe now by clicking this link. And you see the little bell next to the subscribe button? Please click on that bell to get notifications from our channel. And don't forget to click these links below to watch all previous episodes of Hitting the Town. You never know what kind of surprise you will find. <laughs>